In 1976, during President Idamini's regime, Reverend Captain Johnny Businge, who served in Uganda's army, allegedly evicted 35 families from land at Ruhunga in Kashari sub-county in Imbarara district. Captain Businge later obtained a title deed, approximately 452 acres of land here. When Amini's regime collapsed, Businge fled the country and the families who had been evicted repossessed their land. He later returned and sold the title to David Ibakirahache in 1982. Attempts by Ibakirahache to take possession of the land failed, which resulted in a long legal battle with locals. Baguma Isoke, the current chairman of the Uganda Land Commission, was a minister of lands in 1989. Captain Businge provided armed security men to guard the surveyor. Government asked him to investigate this land dispute. In his report, Isoke said Captain Businge did not follow the right procedures in obtaining the title. Businge allegedly used a forged inspection report. Among the people present during the inspection, that there was John Tivinyeva and Mr. Zahikire, Zahikire. When in fact Zahikire had died two years earlier and Mr. Tivinyeva was under detention. Baguma Isoka said in his report in 1989, he advised the conflicting parties to use Ruhunga Hill communally, but his advice was ignored. Mr. Bachirahachi will be free to graze in Ruhunga Hill communally like all the other 35 families. Now, Isoka says in order to resolve this 42-year-old land dispute, government should compensate the family of the late David Bahirakache. Those who have these resources in their titles qualify for compensation from government. He told the Commission of Inquiry that there were no enabling land laws to allow government to repossess hills and valleys for communal use and public use by 1989. Government can move along Article 26 of the Constitution to compulsorily acquire the hill and the valley uh, for public use and also for public order. Today also, my lord, unlike in 1989, there is a land law which put in place a statutory fund whose purpose is to remove the type of paralysis we now see in Rohunga. Out of the 452 acres on the Bahirakache's title, the family occupies 40 acres, with the current market value of land at Ruhunga approximately 5 million shillings per acre. And if government agrees with Baguma Isoke's recommendation to compensate, Bahirakache's family will be paid about 2 billion shillings. Jingo Francis, NTV.